Now, scientists at the International Rice Research are experimenting with climate resistance rice in the Philippines. As scientists, they're extracting genes of desirable traits from rice grains and they're combining them into other varieties of rice to make a more favorable crop here. These are designed to endure adverse climate conditions, including both floods and droughts. Our next report is all the details. This variety of rice is climate resistant and climate smart, designed to withstand droughts, floods and rising sea levels. Scientists at the International Rice Research Institute are testing the experimental plant in these flooded rice paddies in the Philippines. They hope a crop that could withstand the impact of extreme weather will help curb the effects of climate change on agriculture. In Los Banos, south of capital Manila, farmers are planting experimental flood-resistant rice. Scientists say it can survive being submerged in water for up to two weeks longer than regular rice. Shalab Dixit is a senior scientist and plant breeder at the IRRI. With climate change, with increased abiotic and biotic stresses, with a reduced amount of water available, we need better genetics um, for rice to be able to provide stable yields in fluctuating environments. In addition to flood-resistant rice, the team is currently also focused on developing drought-resistant and saline-resistant varieties. Using an advanced breeding method known as marker-assisted breeding, scientists are able to detect genes of desirable traits from rice grains and combine them into other rice varieties to produce a more favourable crop. Rulix Mendoza is a research manager at the Institute. So the donor parent is the one donating the trait, say drought tolerant, submergence tolerant, all those things. And that the recipient parent, this is the one receiving that trait to add to the positive traits that it currently has. So for example, this recipient parent, it, has, it is very high yielding, early maturing, so good eating quality. So you need to put in the, those traits, those drought tolerance, submergence tolerance or cold tolerance to produce offspring having all those traits. The drought-resistant variety carries genes that enable rice crops to survive weeks longer than regular crops and continue to grow with very minimal water. It's now being planted by farmers in India, Nepal and the Philippines. Alex Abortes, a farmer in the northern province of Bulacan known for its droughts, says the climate-resistant rice will definitely improve yields for him. It's good that even if there is no water, there can still be hope, even if there's just a little moisture for the rice to survive. It's difficult sometimes as we can't always plant on certain parts of our farm when there's no water. The Southeast Asian rice producing country is usually hit by an average of 20 tropical storms every year. In 2022, a total of 37.6 million Philippine pesos, more than $670,000 worth of agricultural damages, were caused by floods. That's according to the Philippine Department of Agriculture. And over $450,000 of those damages were rice crops. What we hope is that you know these varieties will lead to, to improved stability and uh, reduced risk in rice cultivation so the farmers can earn better and have less cost of production, which will eventually lead to their income and, and, and other aspects, improvement of other aspects as well in their lives. Beyond is now available in your country. Download the app now, get all the news on the move.